This is the Walmart equipped mosquito hammock. Equipped mosquito hammock. Uh, it comes with straps like this, but these are rather short. I mean, if you're using a small tree and they're the proper length, that's just fine. But they're actually a little short for what we're going to do here. And what I prefer are the Atlas hammock, the Atlas straps, um, which are considerably uh, more flexible and, and longer. So, go ahead. These are simple. There's a loop on one end and several loops on another. We just put them on the tree, and I usually go about shoulder height myself. And then we'll take the hammock, and I'll show you on the hammock the first mod uh, that we've made. And that's this um, snake skin. So, I'm not sure the distance between these trees, but let's just see how this works. Alright, as you see, I have the other strap on a different tree, and uh, I like it rather taut, so I think that looks about right. You can also notice on here, well actually I think we'll get it a little bit tighter. Um, you'll notice I can adjust this by just using the different loops with the, on the tree, on the strap itself. And on the hammock, you'll see my snake skin. Now the snake skin itself is made out of a loofah pad you can pick up at the dollar store or pretty much everywhere and these are one continuous length when you take them apart so it's really handy for uh, well storing the, the hammock and as you see it, it keeps it nice and nice and straight together and to use it you just pull her off and it's as simple as that. Alrighty, well we've got a nice taunt where I like it uh, stretch. Now the next thing we're going to do is in the hammock itself on the top of the mosquito netting there we have two poles and they just are inserted across the top very simple and the straps that it comes with can be either hooked together and they're pretty long so I usually just uh, take them together and hook up hook up, uh, further up on the tree that I'm, that I'm using a simple bow knot So this is real easy to get undone. Now what I've considered also is to exchange these strings, it's like a paracord, um, with elastic, but for the most part this works real well. Same thing on the other end, comes with these little, little extenders. And they go in each end as we did on the other end and then take the strap and you can pretty much put it anywhere convenient in this case I see a little branch sticking out so I'm going to put it on there and just cinch it up like that okay come around to this side so we can show you a little bit better the zipper on the hammock is a full-length zipper so it makes it quite easy to get in and out um, one drawback is that this mosquito netting well I can open it quite a ways and it makes it a little bit easier uh, just to sit here and uh, use it as a nice lounge chair around camp, around camp. 
One thing that I do miss with the mosquito, with the way this is set up, is there's no ridge line. Um, so what I have done is a modification. Whoop. If you can see in here, I have installed, sewn in another line just along the edge that I can use to hang glasses from or whatever when I'm laying down. And then another one that goes across the top. I'm probably going to put a gear loft in, um, but at this point, uh, this works pretty well. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get in. What I like about this hammock, with these spreader bars, there's a lot of headroom. It's almost like a, a small tent. As a matter of fact, I have more room in here than I have in my bivy. But uh, it's excellent, works real well. So, actually, you know, just the way it comes, with the, the mosquito netting set as it is, I think it's just equipped real well. Aptly named, the equipped hammock. <laughs> um, it's $40 at Walmart. I've used this a number of times. Like any hammock, without an underquilt, it could be pretty cool. But I've used my uh, REI um, pad, inflatable pad, and I think it has an insulation value of three and a half or something like that. And with that pad, I've slept quite comfortably down to about 40 degrees. Uh, and that's with a 45 degree sleeping bag itself. Uh, in any event, I showed you I would show how this works. We often use it with a uh, tarp like we did in the Hawaii video. Uh, and if you want to, haven't seen that one, that was a uh, Kokia campground video where we did some hiking uh, on the island of Kauai and uh, used this hammock in one of our camps that we had set up. So, I hope this gives you a little information about this uh, hammock. And until later, keep hiking.